On today's episode, we are getting started on the interior. Cam is going to start painting uh, inside and we're going to start installing some stuff. So that's right, we are starting to finally put stuff together on the inside of this car. What are paint are we using inside? So we're using this uh, white bed liner, so it'll give us a nice, uh, hopefully resistant surface on the interior. Getting in and out of the car, this should be a good option. Yeah. So we'll see how it holds up. The idea there with that color is just to see things. If we left tools in the car. If we left tools in the car. The you know, if nuts and bolts are starting to fall from places we don't know. And tomorrow we're gonna come back and install a roll bar. It's sitting over there. For, it's just a hard dog roll bar. It's actually the one that everyone's been bugging Stefan to put in his car. <laughs> so we're gonna ignore that and put it in the track car. We're just stealing it. We're just gonna steal it and put it in this thing. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. He'll die like a man. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> so let's get started. Dylan, you watch Mighty Car Mods. <laughs> Where does this go? In the bin! Yeah! Well, I guess it's going to have a texture to it, so... Oh, yeah. It's Right, we're back and we're going to do some painting up top here underneath where the roll bar sits. Before we get to painting, we're gonna mock the roll bar up, cut out what needs to be done, and then paint the top. We're thinking black to kind of match the dash. So it's an Oreo. We got black, cookie, filling, white, black. Great observation from Cam. That's a wrap. We have the paint of the interior done. I feel like we've done a ton of different layers, but I love the way that it's come out. We've got the truck bed coating white on the bottom. It's never gonna look this clean. It doesn't even look that clean to begin with at the moment. We've already made it 30, but I'm really happy with how durable it does feel. 
And the black up top, I really like that touch as well. It just makes it look real clean. And the roll bar kind of disappears uh, as well. So that looks good. The roll bar itself, we might use some Loctite on the nuts. So we might take those off and some Loctite them. Pro I would recommend that for anyone doing it on a streetcar for sure. For us, it's really easy to monitor because it's all exposed. But for someone on the street, it's going to be under a bunch of things. Next up for the interior, we are going to cut the dash and flock it, install it, and then put the steering wheel on. Not sure if that will be the next episode that we see. We're doing a lot of things at once here, trying to capture everything and put it up as content for you all so you can all follow along. During today alone, we're working on an intake episode. We're working on a a rear end episode with what we're doing back there. It's pretty interesting stuff, a little scope creep, but that's always a good thing. So yeah, just stay tuned. Episodes coming out every week on Saturday with this track car. Okay, I ran out of contacts earlier this week, so it's been...